In today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you guys Filmic Pro mistakes that beginners make. Or in other words, I've screwed up a lot with Filmic Pro and I want to show you guys what I've done and messed up on so that way you don't make the same mistakes coming up. Hey guys, welcome to Mobile Creators, giving you the tips, tricks, and tools to create awesome content on nothing but your smartphone. So if you're into filmmaking, photography, any kind of content creation on your smartphone, be sure to be watching for those cards up above and check the description. We've got some valuable information if that is your niche. That's it for the self-promotion, so let's get into the content. Filmic Pro mistake number one, stabilization. So when I got my iPhone XR for the first time, I got Filmic Pro downloaded and I started going out and shooting video and filming in 4K and doing a whole bunch of things. But what I began to realize is my footage was super shaky and I couldn't figure out why. It was just always shaky. I was like, is this the iPhone XR? I mean, it's a new phone and out of nowhere, it's shaking like crazy. What I realized is you have to turn on image stabilization within Filmic Pro. You have to make sure it's actually turned on. And if it's off, the slightest move of your finger causes the whole footage to be wrecked. So if your footage is like absolutely out of control, shaky, make sure you have image stabilization on. It's gonna help you a lot if you're doing those hand shots. Filmic Pro mistake number two, automatic white balance. So even if you look at the videos I've made previously on this channel, I keep forgetting and leaving automatic white balance on it. In this video, I made sure that I set it myself. Because here's the thing, if you have automatic white balance on, when you move any bit, it's gonna start changing the white balance and the color of your face will start you know, freaking out and going all over the place. I've noticed this a lot when you're out and about, maybe uh, doing a vlog or even just with certain lighting. You need to make sure that you either have one of the uh, pre-made presets like cloudy or fluorescent light or something like that, or that you're actually just touching that dial and automatically setting it yourself. Otherwise, it's going to completely destroy your footage. Or maybe no one noticed, maybe no one noticed in the past few videos that my face was freaking out like crazy because I had automatic white balance on. But... It's something you'll notice. It's something that will or could wreck your videos. Make sure you are setting it manually or choosing one of the manual presets down below. And the last mistake that I want to cover, it kind of covers two, but they're both in the same setting section, so I'm kind of including them together. It is the device settings. So if you click on device in Filmic Pro and scroll through, there are two things you're going to want to make sure that you have on. Number one is you're going to want orientation lock on. And number two is that you're going to have mute notifications on. Now, obviously, you want to mute notifications because if you're filming something and your notification goes off, it's like, or it makes that noise if you have, you know, your no notification noises on, it's going to completely ruin your video. The reason you want orientation lock on is if you're doing a certain shot where maybe you know it's curved over, you think that you're holding it this way, but your phone for some reason thinks that you're in you know like portrait when you're in landscape, that's gonna ruin your footage too because now you filmed an entire video like this and the camera thought you were filming like this and it screwed up the orientation. So make sure you lock your orientation so that problem doesn't happen to you and that you mute your notifications because that also will mess up your video. Now, if you haven't seen our other Filmic Pro videos, be sure to go and check those out. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys over here. Don't click off.